Hey now, it's time for another approach video. Oh yeah, this one's special. This is from uh, my heyday in 2011, uh, right during that period when I put out like those tons of approaches uh, together. And uh, it might have actually been on the same day after we finished filming. I really can't remember, but it was around that period. And uh, this is a pretty good one. Uh, I had fun with this girl. She's pretty hot. And uh, I was persistent. Uh, check it out yourself, and I'll uh, do a quick comment at the end. Check it out. Hi. Hi. Do you want to get married? <laughs> I am not so sure. No. Look at this. You're you're gorgeous, great body. You've got good dance moves. You're probably friendly. So. You know what? I need to get to know somebody before making sure. that kind of decision. Sure. Well, I'm, I'm Sasha. So, <laughs> Rasa. Hi. But, Rasa. Rasa. Yes, that's it. Interesting it means morning dew. Morning dew. That's it. In. So, if you take a flyer. In what language? In Lithuanian. Haha, <laughs> Lithuanian girls are the best! My ex was from Lithuania. You guys are good. Why are you... It's not good from ex-Lithuania to have another Lithuanian. Really? Yeah, because she's an ex for a reason. Let's try something new. You're right. <laughs> Funny if I just walked away then. Anyway, you're amazing. I, ha I can't have to go home and work. I can't come... What is it? What is it? Uh... Um... Take this time. Every Monday I'm here. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Yes. Oh, that's really hot. You see, now I'm interested. Now I'm really... Stop it because I'll stop flashing. Do you do, do, you do yoga as well? No, no yoga. Yoga is too boring. I, I need to Checking. stop thinking. And How long have you been... Uh... Five years. You're pretty good then, huh? I can dance. <laughs> did you train here or did you go to other countries? Yeah. Oh, yeah. cool. I did a little salsa. I went to uh, Argentina and I, took, I had a tango lesson and that was fucking cool. I do sometimes. Do you? Good yeah. stuff. Really, really fun. Yeah. Come. Every Monday. Maybe. And which, where do you live? What area? Right there. It's very convenient. It is very convenient. Don't be lazy. I won't be lazy. One day I might bring... The guy just spreads compliments and then never comes back. Listen. <laughs> How many guys come chat you up every day? That's what I want to know. None. Liar. You're a dirty, <laughs> terrible liar. I don't believe anything you say. Where do you live? I live in Leeds, actually. Leeds? Yes, but half of the week I'm in London, half of the week I'm in Leeds. Okay, all right. Let me just ask you one important question, and I'll let you continue your hustle. Who's no. the lucky guy? <laughs> there isn't. <laughs> huh? huh? What? Did there you say isn't. there isn't? No. Okay, you must be insane. You must be one of those crazy girls you, you sleep with like a knife under your pillow. No, I broke up with somebody. Okay. How, 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 when? Huh? How recently? Or? Quite recently. Same here. Should we hold each other for comfort? Aww. <laughs> that was awesome. I didn't do that just to fill you up. But no, I am weird, but I'm charming at well, the same time. Well, that way you said it. Well, listen. When you're not doing salsa, what are you doing? I dance every day. Do you? Yeah. You're an addict. I am actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a junkie. I can't get enough. At least it's healthy. Better than heroin. Or cigarettes. Yeah, yeah, the cigarettes aren't good. Yeah. I am trying to cut down. Though. There you are. Well, listen. I could stand here and talk to you all day. You're wonderful. You have, a, you have great energy. Too. You're happy. You're a happy person. You know what the London people are like? I know. What's all that about? I don't know. You put seven million people you know into a city. Nothing thing? works. They, they get angry. They go like zombies. And you know, like if I would give away fire, and they would just just not even react, I'm fine with saying, you know, they know, and it's fine. Don't take it. And I'm not gonna force it. But when they just walk and they ignore you completely. I know. Oh, human being? What? What's wrong with you? You're not just a human being. You're a delicious human being. Well, listen. <laughs> what can I say? You can say that next week or some some week you're going to come and see sure. me again. But more importantly, I'd like to meet you sometime. I guess to know you properly when you're not working. Cup of coffee, you, me. Yes. Sexual tension. What do you think? About the sexual That's a yes. Well, we've, we've got that already. <laughs> I'm actually a teeth drinker, but you know what I mean. There's actually a place called, you know, Joe's across the street. We should go there yes. sometime. When are you, when are you uh, around but not working when you have like an hour free? Right? It's hard to say. You have to catch me. But still, come next week. If you come next week, I'll give you my telephone number. I'm not going to give it now because it's very random. You know, I can't just.
I can't. I can't. I love. Uh, I love how you're. Really nice and you're, cute and everything. You're, but. you're leveraging your number for business. I don't think the boss would approve. That's kind of prostitution, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll give you your number, but I you have to come. Bring five friends. I'll get you my friend's number too. No, it's no, 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 it's not about that. It's not about that. The fact is that in London, you live close by, and this is the place where I'm always on Mondays, so I can always guarantee I'm gonna be here. Cool. But time is Say short. Make it. You care enough? Don't use your boobies. Don't bring your titties into it. That's not that's not fair at all. Look, I'll be honest with you. Uh, I would love to come, but I'm super, super busy. Like, if I don't make it, you'll think I don't like you, and I'm going to feel bad. Well, then so, you're going to make it another week. Or you're going to pop up for five minutes. Just say, hey, I made it. And then I give you my number and there you go. You don't even need to stay. Let's not negotiate. Let's just exchange numbers. Let's and we'll, we'll be in touch. Destiny never works. And those guys were sitting at home and they're playing Dungeons and Dragons. Like I never meet any girls. Those guys left it for Destiny. They're 36. Like they're losing their hair. That's fine. That's not me though. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll try and drop by. And uh, just in case it doesn't work, you're gonna give me your number. I'm gonna send you funny text messages. They'll make you smile. <laughs> you know what? I use that all the time. I did this today. Listen to this. I was in the bank today. And you know if you put money in, they make you, like it's retarded. They make you fill out the form. Everything's electronic. And they're like, can you fill this out? And I go, no. And they say, why not? I said, against my religion, I'm not allowed to do stupid things. And they're like, oh, okay. And then they fill it out for me. And I'm like, yes. I joke around with my friends about starting my own religion called Common Sense. So anytime someone asks me something stupid, I'm just like, oh, I can't do that. That's against my religion, the Common Sense religion. Well, they have something in common then. <laughs> How good would that be? Listen, you're really cool. You laugh at my stupid jokes. I'm not leaving here until I have your number. And listen, but you won't. If you, you won't, give me your number. No, that's because you, you know what's going to happen. You're not going to call me. I'm going to be depressed. I'll just stand here and distract you all day. You'll have a great time, but you won't get any people in. See what I mean? So you might you're as well just. So regret it. I know. One second. Okay. Against littering. I know. Zero seven. I'm gonna give you a missed call, then you'll know, you'll know it's me. So if no, you want to ignore me, you can. Why don't you give me your number and I'll give you a missed call because I don't do remember. Zero oh, seven. Oh, oh, maybe I do. Wait, wait, wait. I'll put mine in. It's the same thing. One second. Yay! I have my number. Okay, okay shoot. Oh seven. Oh seven. Yep. Five. Three, one. Okay, cool. I'm gonna judge you by your ringtone. So if it's like something really cheesy, it better not be Spice Girls. It better not be Spice Girls. Oh, that, that's okay. Cool. Uh, I, spell, uh, oh, spell it. I'm not. I'm gonna fuck it up. Mine is R A S A. Rasa. I need a nickname for you. Uh, I'm gonna call you Buff uh, Salsa Pain in the Ass Girl. You're a pain in the ass girl because it took me 15 minutes to get your fucking phone number. Normally I'm smooth. I can do it in two, maybe three. Only because I like the hair. Game sure. Thank you. <laughs> anyway. Okay. So how do you spell your name then? Sasha. S-A-S-H-A. Yeah, yeah. You can call me Crazy Sasha, which is cool. Crazy Sasha. Crazy hair. Crazy hair, absolutely. So what should we do on our day? I don't want to be boring and take you for nothing. Let's do something more fun. Why did you text me and I'm not working though? Okay. When is a good time to text you? Anytime, really. I'll text back when I can. Cool. But if you call me and I don't pick up, don't be surprised because it might be in a world. Do you like physical things? Do you like things that involve physical? You must. You're a sausage girl. Okay. Right. I know what we're going to do on our day. It's going to be great. Just give me a kiss. I'll see you soon. Oh, very nice to meet you. Very weird. I have, you have to no say. idea. I'll see you soon. Okay. So you can see there, uh, persistence was really the key. Um, her, her boss was like watching her and she was supposed to be working. And obviously she doesn't want to feel like a hoe and give out her number, especially at work. So um, so she was she was giving me the standard test and just trying to sort of like, you know, get yeah, come and see me again, um, you know, get, trying to get all these excuses and stuff. But I, I knew she liked me, I knew it was on. And in my world, I just don't, you know, if it's on, it's on. I'm not gonna like try and come back and, and, and do all this kind of stuff. You know, I'm busy. I told her that if I'm, I'm being pretty honest with it. Um, and yeah, and it just, you know, it really became down to, came down to like, whose reality is stronger? Is it her reality of like, hey, yeah, yeah, just come see me later? Or is it mine of like, listen, this is happening. I like you. You like me. Give me your number and let's hang out. And uh, obviously, Sasha Day Game Reality wins. But that's a great example of a girl can like you and she's just going to, you know, she's just going to keep on making excuses to, to, to get rid of you over and over and over again. But that doesn't mean she's not interested. She just, you know, for whatever reason, um, she just wants to uh, have it go down her way. And you just have to persist. Hope you guys enjoyed that and 
I'll see you next time. Peace.